What's good guys, Obi Effect here, back again with another Vans review. Today I have a pair of Authentics from the Vault line. This is part of the Off the Hook Black Crab Pack. Colorway is black, and these are a size 12. First things first, let's get into the box. As you can tell, it's a pretty much primarily orange box. It is a cardboard box, nothing special on that. You do have the Vans and the Off the Hook branding on the top, as well as that black crab symbol, and kind of like a holographic silver, which is pretty cool. Both face sides of the box have the same look to it. Just picked these up yesterday. Probably one of the last people to get these in, at least in the States. Very happy about how these came out. This pack dropped about two weeks ago and released with two models. You got the Authentic LX and the Skate High Zip LX. Both of these models do feature water resistant uppers. The Authentic only having it on the toe box portion and then the Zip Skate High featured an entire water resistant upper which is pretty cool especially since it's a Zip model. <clears throat> Definitely put a lot of work into these. This is a collaboration between Vans Vault and Chuck Hughes as well as Off The Hook. Chuck Hughes is a famous, I guess like a TV chef, well he's been on a couple shows but he's Montreal based and he is well known for his seafood dishes, so that's probably why they came out with the black crab pack. Saw an interview with him about this collaboration, and I guess he was looking for basically like a water resistant shoe that was easy to wear. Been a fan of Vans for a while, so this was an easy collaboration for him. If you've worked in a, re a restaurant before, you know that water resistant shoes is definitely something that you want to look for especially being around the sink and then of course non-slip grip which I guess Vans just already has standard I really wish they could have put those restaurant outsoles on here the actual non-slip grip but nevertheless still dope the authentics feature this mesh material on the back here it's actually pretty soft very nice mesh it's definitely a breathable shoe. My favorite part of the shoe is actually in the interior. It's not the cork insole, but I'll get to that. It's this lining here on the other side of that mesh. It's kind of like a very, very fine nylon material. Almost feels like basketball shorts. Never seen that material on a pair of Vans before, so that was definitely cool. The cork insole is important because it's pretty much I guess it uh, wicks away moisture pretty good and it keeps odor out so definitely something you would want in a water resistant shoe. You do have that black crab logo there on the interior. Same material under the tongue, that like basketball short mesh, very nice. These feature these wax laces which are also important because they also wick away moisture or you know the water just drips right off of them so definitely a nice touch you got those black metal eyelets the vans tag on the side and then the off the hook behind it that off the hook branding the toe box itself is kind of like a treated nubuck material very nice material i do assume that these are going to be creasing pretty pretty easily though so that's kind of going to be a bummer but Still an awesome look. The extra laces were very strange in this pack. They're like these leather, pretty thick leather laces too. And they kind of got like a green tint to them on the sides here. Definitely won't be putting those in, but it's a nice touch. I guess it's supposed to match that insole. These fit true to size. The Authentics here retail for 90 Canadian and then the Skate Highs were 150 Canadian. Not a bad price once you get to the conversions, you know, for the USD currency, but very happy to have these. These did sell out pretty quick. I believe they sold out nine minutes online and 30 minutes in store. There was a full size run from a three and a half all the way to a 13, which is pretty surprising. Pick up your girl a pair of these for sure. On the back heel tab here, we have that vault branding, the black. 
Not really a fan of black midsoles. This is actually one of the first shoes I've ever bought with a black midsole, but I did really appreciate that water resistant material, that new book. So I really had to just get by this and I'm actually pretty satisfied. They don't look bad at all. It's got like this grayish piping on it. Kind of matches the toe box. Very nice. Then of course those black waffle outsoles. Well, I hope you guys like this review and be sure to stay tuned for the on feet.